Oh, there you are. I uh, got you those orchids. I don't need them anymore. Why? What happened? It's the Contessa. She's, uh... She's married another. I'm, s I'm so sad. Oh, well, I'm sorry. She left me for a postman. <laughs> she married a postman. <laughs> I mean, it's... She's... She's a countess and a postman. I mean, the shame of it. I, I mean, if it was a prince, I could have coped with it, but a, a postman? Life is extremely challenging at times. Tacitus, I want you to kill me. Huh? I, I have a gun. <clears throat> Quite a gun. These are Tahitian pearls. Well, Tahiti? Have you been? Nearly, but I guess we never made it. It's not for people like us, Tacitus. Please, just kill me. What? No. Then give me the gun. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> I think it best for both of us if I keep the gun. I definitely I'm think so I keep the, I'm keeping that. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Jeez. Now I have to go to Baltimore to see my awful sister. Not to let God to smell the gardenias. I'm not <laughs> sure what to tell you. Here's your payment for the orchids. Thank you. I'm too old for love, Tacitus. Too old to live without it. Oh. Wise words. But art will see me through, Tacitus. Surely it shall. Oh. Ah, here. I promised you I'd make something. I have your hat. Oh. Pretend to like it. I couldn't have another rejection. Not now. It's wonderful. You take care, Algernon. Goodbye, Tacitus. Think of me fondly. Oh man. Alright, so there's Algernon's revolver. This gun, man, is. It took me forever to get this thing, man. This thing was a pain in the butt to get, so I figured I would make this video and just give you. give whoever needs it some tips. I don't even know if it's worth getting, man. If I had known when I started this thing how long it would take and just. It's not hard, it's just really tedious because. You have to go around the map collecting um, orchids and killing specific birds, but I'm going to give you guys a few tips. So first of all, I'll, I'm going to link below um, a map with all of the orchid spawns, and that'll make it a little bit easier. But besides that, I also use the variation of the horse spawn uh, trick, which is if you don't know the horse spawn trick, if you go to right here on the map, Sandini, uh, it's either right here or right here. It's a, it's a stables. It's right here, I think. And right here, you'll see, go right here and save and then quit the game and fully quit the game. Like, quit out of the game fully, go to story, go to exit game, and then reload your game because you need, like, the cash or whatever to clear. And every time you spawn in, there'll be new horses there. And good horses spawn there, like the Turkoman and the Arabian, and you can you steal the horses. So instead of spending like I don't know whatever it is two grand on you know an Arabian or a Turkoman, you can just steal them from there, and you can basically get any horse in the game. And you might have to load back in a couple of times, but eventually all of the breeds in the game spawn there, so you can get any horse you want in the game for free. So again, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. So again, go to uh, this area on the map right here. I'll show you again. This area right here that I have, uh, it's right above uh, Saint Denis. It's a stable area. All right, so the variation I used of that was with the birds because you have to kill herons and you have to kill spoonbills. Uh, the area I used to do most of it is right over here between the Kamasa and, Kam I guess the whole thing is the Kamasa River. This, this big island right here because the spoonbill spawn right here, you can see his, his bill is like a spoon. And then um, the herons and the other ones, I don't know which is which, but just walk around this area. There's night orchids here too for the first part, but again, I'll link a map below. But what you want to do is go to this area, not right at the spawn, because sometimes you'll spawn in. If you spawn in right where they spawn in, 
they'll just fly off and you won't get a chance to shoot them. Go like maybe somewhere up here and respawn in. Go kill all the spoonbills or the herons or whatever it is you gotta kill. And then um, at first I was just going to sleep and waiting for the spawn, but it's not. It's even much easier to just spawn in, go kill the herons or the spoonbills or whatever it is you gotta kill, get their plumes. Um, go back here, save, go to exit game, just like you would with the horses, spawn back in, and then it makes it much easier because they'll spawn there, and you know, nine times out of ten they'll be there, and you can just go kill them. Otherwise, it would take forever, and at first that's how I was doing it. I was just randomly trying, like, there are other places they spawn, like, here's one of the spawns, here's one of the spawns, um, you know, over here, over here, over here, but this, this seems to be the better, anyway, I don't know, it's, it's somebody maybe knows a better spot, but this is the area I use, right by the B and Bayou, this whole area right here, I was walking, like, from coast to coast, pretty much, uh, and then I'd respawn in over here, so use that horse spawn trick, and maybe I'll leave, um, a link below with the video with the horse spawn trick, just so you understand what I'm talking about, and I used a variation of that to... Get all the birds, basically, and that made it a lot easier. And uh, I'll leave a map below that has all the orchid spawn locations. That was a pain in the butt, man. And it was a six-part thing. So six times I had to go out. You got to go out and get, you know, night orchids, night orchids, and queen's orchids, and you know, what other? What are the other clamshell orchids? And there's there's all kinds of orchids all over the map. And it's not just in this area. They're all over the map, and it is just. It was a pain in the butt. I spent two actual game days, two two long gaming sessions just doing this one thing, just grinding through it, and it was just a real pain in the butt. So I don't even know if it's going to be worth it for most people, um, but I kind of pushed through it. I thought it was just going to be a quick one-part thing with, you know, kill, you know, um, just a bunch of birds, get a bunch of orchids, and that's it. But no, he sends you out again and again and again. And I don't even know how great the revolver is. Like, a lot of the special guns in this, they're not that great. The regular standby Schofield revolver is better than them. But once I was, you know, once I had gotten into it, I had, you know, that was pretty much it. So I just saw it through. But, and I haven't seen many videos on this gun either. So I, I get the feeling most people are not going to bother with this. Because it is, it is just... Again, it's not hard, it's Please, just tedious. You're making me uncomfortable holding oh. that gun there. Oops. Hey, I didn't mean to do that. I will. I'll put it away. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> Let me